Hey, I'm back. I'm so confused where I was. Oh, there I am. Did I really lose every shot? Of course I did. Why wouldn't I? You know me, but at this point, I'm a terrible shot. Oh my god. Did I miss? I miss. sleep with their rifles. I bet they've given them names. I guess. So, you don't have a name for your gun? <laughs> Hello? Hell no. You do? Well, yeah, kind of. Hey, let's hear it. Well, I call it Dick Justice. I rest my case. What the... Loaded into the level. Oh god. The folder on the table told a grim tale. The mercenaries were running a tight operation, paperwork and all. Merchandise missing again. A chemist had tried to smuggle it out for his own private party. Locked him up in cell B7 and D6's old test facility to wait for proper processing. I was close enough to hear the secrets, just beyond the next doorway. Look 
can I pick up a lead pipe from? Appreciate it. Love it. button there.
still got move. I love this game. I love it so much. You can definitely tell why I love it. fill the control room screens all but one an elevator titled d6 on one of the screens somewhere onwards past rows of ovens in the core of the plant oh you sicky little bastard me on it. This part in the game, boy. Go, 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 go. Okay. Oh my god. Oh! Well, I know what I'm using. What the fuck?
There we go. Hold on. Is that it? Did we win? Are we good? No, we're not. We are not. Okay, right. Oh, there we go. Wait. Wait, no. Let's make this jump. Nope. Nope. There we go. Oh no. This is not good. Go, go, go. Report. Sam Spade going after the Maltese Falcon to unravel all the mysteries. Following a path of clues to that final revelation, even if it would take me down to the cold, cavernous depths of a grave. Very sure you died, You can't do this. My men are still inside. Do you have any idea why this is called Operation Dead Eyes? It might be that. <laughs> Let's do it. Attention all personnel. The self-destruction sequence has been initiated. Evacuate the complex We've immediately. We've got company. Repeat. The self-destruction sequence Oh, what the fuck? Bullets can go through? I had seen the logo on the floor before. There was an old army bunker under the steel mill. I knew the military plaque on the floor. I had seen a thousand variations of the insignia on crumbling brick walls everywhere in the city. The sword replaced by a syringe. Project Valhalla. V for Valkyr. V for Valhalla. All of a sudden it read like a crackpot conspiracy theory. Unravel. Can I... can I put self-destruct? Why even fight me at this point? Just get out! Oh. 
reason I feel like all these guys are gonna be let loose as soon as I type in a password or something. Hey, in here! Hey, hey get me out of here! Thanks. I thought I was gonna die in there for sure. I need you to get me through the decontamination chamber airlock. You're crazy! No way! The place is blowing up for Christ's sakes! Either that or back to the cell. Your choice. Okay, okay, I'll do it. I'll do it. Attention all personnel. The self-destruction sequence has been initiated. Proceed to Are the nearest exit moving? immediately. I don't want to die here. Well, calm down. You're good, you're good. Bill. Get in. I'll punch you through. After this, you can go. Decontamination. Might have died. Oh well. Oh, God. Oh, he died. No happy ending for him. What's funny is that they were probably trying to get him for me, but they're just really bad shots. Deadly web that was the Valkyr case. One of the lab terminals had the project logo on the screen. Top secret Project Valhalla, U.S. Army, Yggdrasil Network, Valhalla. The otherworldly place in Norse mythology where the bravest heroes spent their afterlife feasting and fighting forever. Their wounds miraculously healed night after night. Valkyr, the maidens who chose the most courageous Viking warriors and carried them to Valhalla. 1991, the research objective is to create a chemical substance to enhance the stamina and morale of infantry troops. 1995, results unsatisfactory. Project cancelled. Someone had decided to continue the sick experiment unauthorized. Project compromised. Data leak. Fix the damage by any means necessary. Security clearance red. Authorized by the project lead. Field test. Double the dosage for all the remaining test subjects. Observe and record the subject's behavior in an urban setting. The drop-off point was my old address in New Jersey. The file dated three years ago. Just when you thought you had reached the deepest depths of horror, it suddenly got worse. How to turn off that small voice inside your head that started to whisper that you should be glad that now, if not before, your revenge was justifiable on any conceivable moral scale. That small voice proved beyond any doubt that I was damned. The dagger-heeled woman had come and gone a long time ago. There was nothing more for me here. The bunker's name was acting as a self-fulfilling prophecy. Oh, not my place. Oh. 
piece together a jigsaw and the final picture is you finishing that same puzzle. A mad, green-eyed killer standing behind you. An urban legend come true. The Project Valhalla test subjects had been the mad junkies who had murdered my loved ones. The rest was simple body count math. It all pointed to her. Ms. Valkyr. The factory went up in a fiery inferno behind me. All my leads were dead, turned to smoke and dust. I had lost my way. I hadn't slept in a million years. I felt thin as death. I've been living on an endless supply of weak old donuts. They were fuel for this crazy furnace inside my head. I couldn't remember when I had last seen the sun. I was on a permanent graveyard shift. When the darkness fell, New York City became something else, any old Sinatra song notwithstanding. Bad things happened in the night, on the streets of that other city, Noir York City. I was in an all-night diner, downing cup after cup of coffee that tasted like engine oil, when a new message from BB got me back on the killer track. What the hell happened at Roscoe Street? Maxie, I'm going out on a limb here. We need to talk this through, come up with a plan. 2.30 a.m., the Choir Communications Garage. The more I thought about Alex's murder in the frame-up, the more it felt like an inside job. I should have seen it coming. BB had sold me out, and now he wanted to finish what he'd started. The garage was dead. BB showed up in his tailor-made suit, gold watch, and cufflinks to match, all way beyond a cop's pay. Maxi. Oozing suave charm, he was guilty as hell. What the hell does BB stand for anyway? Backstabbing bastard? Come on, don't be like that. Have a cigar. I don't smoke. Maxie, you have no idea how big this is. It's huge. You have no idea. I think I do. You're a bribe-taking bent cop who sold out his partner. Those mobsters in the subway were a dead giveaway. Hard to miss. Bet it was exactly like this with Alex. Up close and personal. You can't win this one, Max. No, but I can make damn sure none of you do either. BB turned out to be another cardboard cutout bad guy. A bad cop on the take. A cowardly right-hand man fleeing from the scene, leaving his paid thugs to do his dirty work. Got un horribly injured. How many bullets are these guys taking? But, oh god.
God damn it. Wait, I'm going back. What am I doing? How do I get back down? No, oh, over here. Of course. That's silly of me. Wait, shit, I missed, I missed. I killed him. All right. Barely. Yeah, no, on the PS2 you'd have to do this entire part in one life. It used to be the hardest thing I could do.
Cut it on count. Cut it on not count. Wow. What the fuck? That should have killed him. Seriously, how did they not all die from that at the same time? Ridiculous! Oh god, oh, ooh! I need to wait for them to turn around the corner over here. This parking lot. Why did I meet him all the way up? Up. Oh. You make one wrong turn. You punish it for it. God damn it! Thanks for the help. Oh my god. Even if it's one guy, it's one guy less I have to deal with. Might be it. There's still another, there's still another floor. There's still another floor. There's barely any cars here. Look up. Why do you need so many parking spaces? I miss payphones, even though I never used one. I should. If I ever find one, just make a call for myself. Because why not? Wait, if I blew up? Tell me that ghost car's still alive? Huh? Oh, whew. Nope, he's still alive, but is that a grenade launcher?
Wait, what? Was that it? Nice. Well, I guess that was it. Oh god. Why do they all have jackhammers? It's all over. The phone started to ring. Conception, this building actually predates the city hall by two years, thus being the oldest municipal building still in use here at the foot of the Brooklyn Bridge. No kidding. The old man played tour guide as he led me through a dark, domed hall. The answers I was after loomed large ahead. Mr. Payne, I would like to introduce you to my colleagues in what we call the Inner Circle. You've been watching too much X-Files. You have seen the files on Project Valhalla. We can fill the gaps, provide you with the information missing from those files. We were all involved in the early stages of the project during the Gulf War. What's the catch? We would very much like to blow this thing wide open, but our hands are tied. Her name is Nicole Horn. She was the key figure in Project Valhalla. When the funding was discontinued, she simply refused to quit. She knew exactly what she had in her hands. Nicole Horn is the president of Acer Corporation. She has more than half the city in her pocket. This must be kept under wraps. If you try to go public with this, we will deny any knowledge. We need you to take her out. Afterwards, we can protect you. Make all the charges go away. That was the cue for the killer suits to kick in the doors and swarm inside. Oh boy. floor show, but I decided to leave early anyway. It was only a one-story fall. Lucky me. Ow. Alright, I think this is where I'll end it for now.